Hi everybody and today I'm here with mixed daily training. Let's have fun and let's go. Hi everybody. Okay. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Playing in Snizzle Goop. Well this guy is strong, that's gonna be interesting. Okay, hello, good luck and let's go. Hi Karma, how are you? Hi Ziggy Zaga, how are you doing guys? Oh look, D1. Okay. Isaiah Neon, how are you doing guys? Uh, so is this the slime where I play B595 and then I suck? I think so. I'm not sure. D1 is pretty unusual. But I think this is how you play it. Maybe it's rook A7, I don't know. I'm not super familiar with rook D1 to be fair. But I think it's fine. Uh-huh. I'm not sure about C6. I'm not hundred percent sure if it's the best move. Okay. I've actually had something similar in an IRL game where I'm in OTB. I didn't go for Catalan, I think, but yeah, I don't know. Since similar, I think. Yeah, I don't know, yeah, B3. Interesting. Okay, so C takes B, takes bishop B7 should be fine, I guess. Alright, to let check, how are you? I guess bishop B7. Uh -huh. Bishop A3, yep. It's more coffee. Karma, are you tired? Okay, let's say nice here to that chick. You sleepy or why do you need more coffee? Hmm. I guess queen e7 is fine. We can play knight d7, then like bishop c6, I'm not sure. Queen e7, knight c6, bishop c6, queen c6, rook c6, queen a6, I'm a pawn down. But after this, this I have that, and this I have king h8, and this, if this I have rook c8, I'm fine, and this queen b6, I don't know what my ideas are, but I think it is okay. And this, let's make sure that a doesn't have anything. Let's do that, I guess. My panda. A bit tired after work, okay. Just two days left. You can do it, guys. If ninety seven just take perhaps even with the knight attack in the pawn because he can take rook c eight f so I'm not sure. Pretty new position for me to play as black. I've sometimes gotten this position as white. 
well not this position exactly but kind of positions you know where you suck the c pawn but then you take c6 as i said yeah i've had something super similar in OTB game, I messed up, I was lost, but then I opened and didn't see. In ad smart move with 95 ideas. Very smart, then to just make my bishop look like a giant pawn. So if queen e7, this, this, take, rook f d8. Ideas like a5, b4, I guess. He plays b for you and no it feels fine like queen e7 85 and if uh queen e7 85 take queen c5 i take take rook d8 rook d6 i have 98 and as i say bring my king over and b5 doesn't work i mean yeah he has b5 but then he play i think queen e7 is fine and if he takes of course there's rook fc8 or rook ac8 so i'm not particularly sure but maybe maybe 95 feels it is gonna be worse than i thought it will be we just have we'll just have to see It's like otherwise knight c5, I don't know. Now I'm at least okay, knight b1. What is this? Ooh. Interesting. <laughs> okay, what if I just play e5 now? Knight c5 I take. I mean then I have rook fd8, bishop c8 stuff. I am not worse, I hope. Uh and if e5 take take now knight c5 I still have bishop c8 regroup, you know? But e5? I'm not sure I'm tempted to go for it. I don't know how to go for it, I guess. It's like knight c5 I take, queen c5, I mean, I don't know, it just doesn't feel... I mean, after knight c5 take, take, queen c5, I have rook f8 and queen c7 take, I mean, it doesn't even have a block on c5. So I think it should be fine, and if knight c5 take, I have bishop c8, even perhaps, okay, yeah, he takes, I mean, I have to take. Now I have knight c5, I mean, I have this, I have bishop c8 as well. I am <clears throat> not super sure. Of course, maybe, yeah, of course, it's not worse, most likely. But I'm also hopefully not worse. So I think the move I'm going to play here is rook f to d8. So if takes and takes queen b6, I'm fine. And if takes, takes a6, I mean, it just can be worse. And it does have knight c3, so I think... Rook of d8 should be fine. Hi Andy, how are you? Yeah, 92. But still, can't I go like bishop c8? Good thing, that's nice. Nice to hear. Long time to see. Nice to have you here. And bishop c8, yes. No, but f feels wrong because knight e g4, queen e3. Bishop c8, knight d4. I mean, bishop of 5 is there. But to bishop c8, where do I bring my bishop? That's a question. You're a bad man today, yeah, yeah. I mean, I can go knight c4 and after this take with the rook, take, take. Queen b2 take, I'm better. I you know, maybe not better, but not worse. But I'm not sure. There he is, like, queen c6, bishop c6, knight c5, so I'm not sure. I kind of got to make a move. Hmm. Or I go a5, bishop a6 stuff. I kind of got to make it look like real bad now, real quick. Hmm. I don't know. What do I play? I don't know, G6 was this, this is some use. I don't know. Most likely quite a bad move. 
Winter and Treasure, yeah. A g6 is probably an awful move. But like, I want to play bishop c8, but then bishop doesn't have any good squares, you know. I mean, g4 no use, d7 ugly, e6 ugly as well, pretty much. Yeah, he goes b4. Um. Um. Mm. Well, but a5, b8. Rook t, no, but then rook d2 doesn't work. 95 is the idea of taking. Is it going high B4? Doing fine, thanks. How about you? Where did my clock go? That's a question. Rook D4. You will think that's nice. I don't know, position is so complex and I just have two minutes. <laughs> I don't know how to play. It's way too complex. Yeah, I don't know. I'm four minutes down somehow. Uh, even though, like, I didn't think at all, as it felt like. <laughs> no, but I guess I did. Mm. Okay, bishop of five. Let's get some active play. Wait, but knight c4? Wait, I'm not sure about queen b2. Didn't he just walk right into knight c4? I at least get some tempos. What is B four one four one? What do you mean, Andy? What do you mean? I mean B two feels odd, you know. I mean even Queen A two would be better, I think. Why am I pre moving Rook? Ah, well, yeah, because I have to. <laughs> yeah, now I thought Knight D five. No, but Knight D five no. Ah, B four. Yeah, exactly. That's true. That's true. Ninety-four. I have no time. <laughs> I'm not sure about ninety-four. 95 felt odd because he takes in like 94, just puts a huge block. Yeah, that's a good one, exactly. Yeah. yeah. I mean, he could have taken d1, taken e2, and after rook e1, play queen b2, but then he could have taken bishop c6, knight a6. I'm not worse. Probably should have went for it, but I don't know. Uh, there is just bishop c6, rook d8, knight a6, knight d3, I'm fine. Oh well, 94, my idea is just to trade some pieces off to make it seem easier to think, you know, but yeah, we'll see. Queen f3. Go rook g8. I don't know. I just want to trade everything, so it will be less, less, less crazy stuff. Perhaps not the best uh, stuff I could do. Oh gosh! But then he takes e4. Oh well, gonna handle it somehow. Maybe we should see it. Kinda has to take, I guess. 
and we can play e4 for now. There you go. Okay, h3. What is h3? Why are you doing this to me? I didn't even think about H3, sir. What is H3? <laughs> I didn't even consider it. Yay. G for goodness me, that's scary. I think I can take. Takes. Oh. Wait, did he block or what? One missing foot. Queen d4, queen d3, queen d8, queen d7, queen d4, f6, queen d7, this I take, queen d7, king a6, still good. And f93, queen g2, queen trade idea. I think you plundered, but I'm not sure. And the good thing is after queen of three take take I have b for this knight d two, whenever it does b three b two b one, it's for coffee. Karma, don't don't drink too much coffee because then you won't fall asleep. So you gotta be careful. And queen g three take take, knight g three bishop of three b four, king of four b three. This this he can't stop me. Wait, is this winning? Is he just blunder in one move? Time is kind of close already. I think it's winning. Yeah, queen of three, but now this. Knight b6 is possible by saying b4 all on b4. If he does nothing, then I promote. If this, this. Yeah, works as well, because I guard the both squares and king g2, b3. He can have to b2, he can I mean he can play bishop a2 and then it will be just knight 3 versus just 3 pawns. Should be good. Another little goop. Hey, I'm not sure if it was a great game, but I mean, he blundered. <laughs> that works. Goodness me, I had so little time. That was. I never played this as black. I was just so confused on what to play, you know? That was insane. Okay, knight c5 was a mistake. I just didn't know what to do. Yeah, perhaps knight e5. It was. Yeah, okay, I played 1 1 on ill. So it wasn't that bad as I thought. 
So no way, nothing. I somehow played. I just made. I played a perfect game except two moves where I made an inaccuracy and then a mistake. I mean, yeah, 94 probably isn't the best move, but my goal in mind was just like to. to, to yes, computer says just to trade everything and then hold there. Gee, thanks, Karma. Mm, and 95, I'd go for knight e5 and then knight. Yeah, I know. I just wanted to simplify as much as I can. I'm doing great. What about you? I'm doing good as well. Thanks, Pookie. Played a good game. I mean, it was a dead draw of like 50 seconds versus 4 minutes. 3 minutes, sorry. And queen d3. Yeah, just play queen f4, queen e2. I'm better, but like, I'm sure if I would win. And queen this. Queen d5, there is knight e3. If queen d8, there is this. Check, I go f6. Check, I go here. This, I take. He does have no check. He has no checks. Queen d2, I'm winning. If queen a there is king g7. This, f6. Same story. And then I take, I push the passer or like eat the pawns. And like queen g3, I could have taken knight e3. He moves the bishop somewhere, push. King here, this push I promote. And if this I just took, and then b4, this, and then b3, b2, and so on. Yeah, I just won. That's a crazy game. Hi, Darko, how are you doing, guys? Poof. Mm, that was insane. Goodness me. I didn't play badly. Yeah, I was. I mean, I, I, I knew more or less how to play. I had the game IRL, OTB. Why am I saying IRL? OTB, I had something similar on the S5, so... Mm. Yeah, that was a wild game. What is this? Yeah, I mean, how are you? What is this? So if I take the free queen, there is knight g3, king e1, rook e7. I just made me right... Yeah. So I'm saying I'm going to be one. I'm back, I play the bolt. I'm good to you. I'm doing good as well, thanks. I'm bishop e1, it feels good, no? If this, I just take, take, no, well, maybe take e4, take h4, take g2, or take queen d4, I don't know. Because, I mean, bishop e4, he has queen e4, I'm not, yeah. Yeah. Oh, his animation puzzles are so weird, goodness me. Take the knight. I was check. I didn't even consider check. What did I do? Wait, I'm sure after. Okay, that's that is deep. That's why I was thirty-seven ninety-three. A one move one, for sure. Uh, I have this. I have that. If queen c queen c three, there is king g two. I have no checks, and I think I fade promotes. And if queen d seven, bishop f five, I take, I win. If rook f five, there is queen c three. What's yellow right now? What do you mean? Where? Yellow to be twenty three. Search. I can play in the same. Now, ah, wait a sec. I have queen f. Wait, maybe it's this and then take. But after queen f1, there is king g3. And if I take, 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 there is rook f2, I'm not sure. So I either play queen c3 or queen f1, guys. What do you think? In bullet. In bullet, when in, I'm not sure rank. Like my rating is 2942, rank 102. Um, queen f1 feels cool. But after this queen g3, if queen f5, take, take, I'm not sure. Queen c3 is cool as well, but after king g4, am I just out of checks? I think so. I think it's queen f1. Yep. Uh, but yeah, I'm right. Or am I wrong? Uh, maybe I should check him. If rook e5, then I take. If king g4, I check him again, then I take. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, okay, that was a nice puzzle. Why is she shooting? I, it's, I I lowered it. When a funky stick twenty six A I mean yeah yeah. Good good good. Good good good. Wait, if I take I mean he has to take and then queen b4. Threatening the bishop and the knight. If knight b3 I go bishop c three. Is knight c6? Oh did I just miss knight b5? I'm not sure. Did I miss him before? Well, why is queen before bad? I mean, I guess so, right? Queen before, knight b5, and then take my queen's trap. Okay, yeah. Should have spent a, a bit more time, huh? Okay, I mean, it's queen h8, 100%. Bishop h6, or rook c1 first. 
I'm not sure. Bishop h6, knight c3, but rook c1 feels right. I mean, if you move the queen, I have bishop h6, queen you cheat anyways, and otherwise I have bishop h6 anyways. Guys, that was the hardest puzzle I've solved in my, my history. I don't know how I solved it in three seconds. And that was insane. Guys, I'm insane. I solved this puzzle! Oh my goodness, in three seconds! I'm too good! I beat chess! <laughs> how did I get beat in one puzzle? What? Ha! Huh? Okay. We take this, we take this. I uh, definitely do. <laughs> No, but still, what? How? Interesting. Okay, so c5, queen c6, I have knight e5, this, this, queen d6, knight e4, queen c6, knight e5, queen c6, I have bishop e4, and then I'm we Oh, that's actually brilliant. This, 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 if queen c6, I can go rook c1, but I'll go knight e5, queen e6, knight e4, queen c6, knight e5, queen d6, bishop e4, and take up c7. And if c5, this, this, queen d6, then perhaps I do that and then play rook c1 and no, okay, but it's c5 100% and now I'm gonna think. Right here. A bishop is three here. Bishop c five takes rook c one queen d six. Knight c seven take is exchange enough. B four, but b four queen d six. I don't think it works, does it? Or do you mean bishop is three queen d six b? No, but then he has ninety five. B four queen d six, I think, doesn't work. Up uh, so perhaps it's in d four. Look, d4 and then b4, and queen d6, I have this, yeah, it's d4 and then b4, yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, that was nice, yeah, d4 first and b4, yeah, 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 I mean, you're spotting some nice tactics, and yeah, Colex, also, also a good idea, because I thought that, it was that it's something like that, like d4, but I didn't get deeper, but then d4, b4, then yeah, it works. So good job, guys. The Queen e2, 96. Hold on, but um, I saw this. 96 doesn't feel good. Maybe it is, I don't know. I mean, I have 92 there. Okay, not 92, queen e2. Uh, this threat to take. The idea is to take. And if 94 is bishop 7, and if castle, there is 97. So this, if bishop d6, I thought queen e2. And I wasn't sure if castle this. Oops, queen e4. Oops, not rook e8. Uh, I'm not sure. Doesn't feel great. To rook e8, it doesn't feel too great. Now yeah, my queen's stuck. Hi, Rafael and how are you doing? Nate, yes, you all? I'm not sure I'm struggling. I mean, BF4, he as well as D6. Good here thing, that's nice. BF4, he is D6. I'm not sure. This smoke off the camera. How many cups have you drunk already? <laughs> How many cups have you drunk? Oh my goodness, chill. I bet should be something like castle. Oh, that's actually interesting. Ooh. Oh, I'm just kidding. Okay. 
so yeah that's actually an interesting castle wow and if castle then rookie no but castle rookie one yeah but if he castles i gotta take first right and then take rookie one and if king h8 i did not know okay good oh that actually looks good yeah Ooh. okay i'm gonna ah uh, yeah good job i mean and now i think you take and then rookie one right i think so seven ninety seven 97 bishop of seven yeah maybe but there nothing is there is nothing now it's gotta be takes and i think rookie won and now 92 fc yeah great great spot i man that was impressive yeah castle that's like a move you never want to do in puzzle i mean it's such it's such a waiting move it's so hard to spot right you're like playing just a normal game yeah that was impressive i man to give him credit for that guys that was impressive wow 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 a castle crazy now it's if this he has d5 no wait uh d5 e takes d queen uh, okay so rook b7 d5 if e takes d king d6 there is rook d7 mate this this e takes the king d5 there is queen d3 this that mate so it's gotta be rook b7 yes he does this i just thought i need the rook on the file yeah exactly i thought i need to bring queen i thought i need to have the queen on the file but yeah rook rook was a killer there and now isn't it just oh wait rook f1 queen c1 i gotta be careful because if this there is rook h1 so is it knight of c or queen oh knight of c rook of c or queen f3 queen of c feels odd right to just trade the queens off and then i don't know i mean maybe i'm fine there ah uh, but no wait there he has rook h2 no it just feels wrong uh, rook f4 is there and then rook e4 so it's gonna be rook it was king f2 right it was king g2 no was it queen f? it was queen f3 i ah, then king f2 well i was in rook f3 though Let's check from here. Ah, okay, yeah, makes sense. Makes sense. Goodness me, guys! So this hangs, this hangs, and this hangs. And if I take the bishop on e for this is gonna hang. His pieces are all hanging. What is this? I mean, isn't it just bishop d two? And two bishops hang, right? Just yeah, exactly. Wait, but now rook e7, rook h2, rook e8, king e7, rook g8, right? Maybe that's a puzzle. Or do I not take? Really? Okay. So three, six correct and three failed. Great job to Ayman for Ayman for spotting a lot of puzzles and yeah. Great job, guys. That was quite cool. Uh, now let's do this. A six out of three is quite good, not gonna lie. Let's do that. Uh, is it there? Yes, it is. And let's play against Mr. Stockfish. Whoa! Oops, I, I thought I already turned it on. Hold on. Uh, blindfold cheers. Yes. Okay, now let's go. Now let's go. Um, D4, D6. Okay. Kitten's Indian. Uh oh. C5, okay. So Sicilian. Sits Indian. Uh, bishop E2. Mm -hmm. I don't know what's H6. I guess I profit that. And A6, okay. Well, I'll just develop. Yeah, h3 takes. Oh my goodness. Ah, he's triggering me. H6, then a6, then b6 without even castling. Ooh, what is he doing? Triggers 
Excuse me. What are you doing? Develop your pieces, sir. Okay, I guess I'm gonna go knight d5 f3. I mean, maybe a little trap, but of course your play should be 7, right? Hopefully not. But he does. Okay, now f3. I don't know. e6. What is he doing? Okay, let's go knight c3, I guess? I don't know. Yeah. Guys, can s interesting game will be, I can tell, yeah. And now he goes knight h5. Guys, can somebody teach uh, this, this guy, please, how to play openings without triggering your opponents or no? I don't know, queen to it? I guess I'll just develop. Come on, now he can't even castle. I played h3. When did I play h3? What? Ah, when I was developing. I thought like, okay, okay. That's why you played knight h5. Okay, that, that makes more sense, okay. Uh -huh. And now g5. This still triggers me. What is g5? <laughs> Guys, what is this? He's just pushing the pawns and doesn't even care about development. Huh? The rook ad1, I guess. Wow. Is he gonna go f5 or h5? Bishop b5. Okay. I mean, animal right move. Uh, I guess knight c2, bishop d4, bishop b5. Yeah, that's right. He's going all in. Uh, hopefully not. Hopefully he'll just castle in and... Ha! Ah, he did! He finally made the normal move! Guys! A miracle has happened. Okay, let's go bishop d4. See if I miss a draw? What after? What he'll do bishop after bishop b3? Queen f6. Am I am I insane or is he wait the bishop before doesn't it just win a pawn? Or did he not play no he played d6 move on. Oh my goodness this is gonna be fun. So you he's telling that takes uh, well not takes with a queen. Queen d6, 95. He's telling me he'll sack two pawns and he's fine? Or am I am I forgetting okay takes? I don't know. Maybe I'm forgetting something. Takes? But he played it. Yeah, I mean, he played a6. So he's giving me b6 as well? What? I'm so confused! What is this? I even have 95! What is this guy doing? Or what am I thinking? No, but wait, 95, right? If he, if he takes, I take. And bishop d5, if I can take or c, d, or e, d. And queen b6 is cool, but then like rook b8, I'm not so sure. Or am I just two pawns up there without any competition? <laughs> I think I'm going to play knight d5. Terrified making moves like that. A queen g5. Wow. Uh, but that is insane chess this guy's playing. Oh, wow, I blundered. Uh, but h4? Uh, but then take, take, knight fc, this queen, h4, this mate? Oh my goodness, that's nasty stuff, wow. And what if h4, knight, e2, I take with the knight, and this I go here, and this I take? Maybe I'm getting checkmate, but I don't know. I'll go for it. Yeah, knight e2, knight... Where's my knight on e2? Oh, I have my knight on c2. Ah, okay. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, this game just confused me so much. Uh, I just messed up my pieces location. Oops. Oops. Uh, yeah, I mean, okay, king f1. This guy confused me too much. Oh, is it actually a draw or is he trolling? <laughs> what is this? 
Oh, it takes, okay. Now, what's your it's maybe not that bad, is it? Now, what, this game is completely insane, wow. I probably am just lost, though. Ah, uh, my goodness. Yeah, but, I don't know. Let's go against 97, queen c7. I forgot that I moved my c3 knight to d5. Queen c7. Queen g4, so you second the bishop? But then he's telling me that f3 is good. I'll go for it. Yeah, can you one? And then, no, but, uh, yeah. What is this game, guys? Knight e3, I guess, prevent in ig4. Yes, gonna see, but then king e1. So he's sacrificing the rook. Wow, okay, takes. And I'm that lost. <laughs> Me so much wow no, but that, guys that, that is some content from both of us mostly from him that's insane um i know you're just just meeting me wow that's impressive and the issue is i can go look at one person id3 checkmate wow now that is some nasty stuff. What an attack that was! How am I supposed to calculate all that blindfolded? Wow! I think I'm just getting checkmated. <laughs> oh wow! That was insane! I don't I, he's just checkmating me. Guys, that was crazy. I'm still in shock. I just don't have a move out tonight to get checkmated in two or three. Wow. And I have queen of seven. Which I'm gonna try because I don't have anything else. Going for content. Uh, eh, let's go rook g1. And that should be a fortress. Uh, okay, king of one. <gasps> Guys, rook g7 if takes 93. Oh, he has a pawn here. Okay, I don't know what I did in this game. I just played a really awful game. Uh, that was terrible. I just forgot so many things. Okay, that was awful. Queen G1, this, it just made me please. <laughs> Knight G5, I guess. No, but he played impressive chess. Oh, perpetual? No perpetual. Yeah. And made another game, so shell 7. What was this game? What was that? What was B6? I have so many questions. Yeah, I'm just plus one. I saw it have 4 on h2, you know? Okay, 95 for Sablan, I just had to take. Alright, yeah, I thought so, but I don't know. Yeah, nice game from him, he played. And then 97 still would be fine, I decided to go h4. I saw it have knight there. If I would have a knight there, then it would be fine. I think, somewhat. Uh, yeah, so, I mean, I played first 21 moves perfectly. Yeah, I just had to go b6. I wanted to take b6, but I played knight e5, and then slowly but surely. So 1, 1, 3 for me, and 1, nil 1 for him. Knight e7, and now king of 2, and I'm actually surviving. Yeah, rook d8, knight d5, take e d, and I'm surviving. Okay. No, but that was just purely insane insanity, guys. That was insane. Okay, now, now let's get revenge to level 6. Let's go. Okay, playing with the black pieces, and let's go!
Hmm. Then close to sit in. Interesting choice, to be honest. Da -da 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 D6. I used if you'll play 92, that's what I used to play like three years ago. Okay, Queen D2, yeah, I play this stuff as well. Too early Queen D2 is good though. It's like what's the point? I haven't even developed my knight. Knight G2? Yeah. I don't know, let's go knight f6. Now, now this queen d2 is useful. So he has bishop h6, yes, castle. Yeah, he'll probably have an attack, but hopefully won't be that strong, you know. f4, queen b6. Knight d5, okay. An interesting looking move, and I think I'm going to go knight d4, so then he takes, and it should be fine if he takes. He plays knight c3, I don't know, okay, yeah, he takes, and now my idea is like queen c5, bishop d5, I guess. Oh my goodness, f5, is he going to make me? He'll go queen c5, just, just trying to take that pawn. Aha, uh -huh, b4, makes sense. This guy is aggressive as well, okay, I'm going to go queen c8 with the idea of capturing that pawn. Maybe I'd go queen c7 though. f6? But wait, don't I have a pawn here? Don't, didn't he just give away a pawn for no? I Maybe there is compensation, but I'm not sure if there is. Um, um, yeah, I guess there is queen f4 attacking three pawns at once. Crazy. Um, ba -ba 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 -da. I think I know queen d8. So if queen f4, then there is just one pawn, then I have rook c8 attacking his pawn. I don't know. Yeah, okay. Let's go rook c8. Takes, takes c2. Yeah. Here is what maybe I should play f5 and after queen d4 let him take and play rook f8. But I have double pawns, but he also has double pawns. But I'm not sure he'll, if he'll play like f4, that's gonna be very c4, I mean, it's gonna be very, very scary. Maybe rook, uh, but rook c3 this takes, I don't know. Let's go f5, queen f6. Looks, looks fine. Yeah, it takes after rook e2, perhaps just play rook c3, put in block. I don't know, we'll see. Yeah, rook f2, rook c3, now this hangs. And my idea is to double up. Uh huh. If gf, I thought rook c2 and fg take, take hg. Yeah, so it goes here, but doesn't d3 hang now and then d5 can hang? I'm not sure. Guess it does, but probably it's a sacrifice. Or maybe it's a blunder, I'm not sure. So rook d3, g takes f, I have bishop d5, no, but rook, wait, 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 rook d3, g takes f, I have g5, and I just closed everything, now a3 hangs and bishop d5, yeah, I like that, I do like that. Yes, and now g5, so this, now my king is blocking that pawn, this pawn is blocked by this pawn, and now he plays rook f3. I'm not sure about that move, I think I'm gonna go... Okay, it's a good move probably because he protects the pawn. But I can take it and play rook c3, rook a3. Don't take a5 because it's like a shield for my king. So yeah, I think I'm going to do that and then take a3. Go back to c3 and we'll see. Yes, yeah, so rook c3 adding in the bishop and the pawn. Uh, takes the idea is rook c3. He has that. I don't think it's... No, he, does, he, can, he doesn't have it. Because if you play c4, I would take. He takes rook f3, take bishop d5 and rook e4, king f5 from winning. Uh, now let's go rook c3 with rook c4 ideas. Ah, bishop, wait, but bishop d3 just gives d5 away, no? And rook a1, I have bishop b7. Interesting. Okay, yeah, he just sacrificed or blundered. 
Mature pawn. If let's see bishop c4, if king d2 rook is three, bishop b4 that I'm winning, bishop c4 you take I'm winning. But if bishop c4 there is king d4, you go rook e3, he takes, takes, takes c4, takes king d5, and then he has a passer, so I'm not sure. Um mm, definitely not sure. Uh, I have king e5, but then there is rook e1 king d2, so I don't think it's good. Yeah, that's unfortunate that rook a3. I mean, maybe it works. Let's check again. This, 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 this. There's king d5, and I cannot stop him taking my pawn. It's there. It's going to be... I'm not sure. It doesn't feel that safe there. Perhaps another idea is to go bishop b7, rook c8, and then just start pushing the queen side, or king side pawns. I think that's what I'm going to do. Yes, yeah, so just maybe actually rook c7, so if rook e7 if needed. Wait, but c4 you just take, right? And if this, this bishop c4 you take and win, if can, what is he doing? And king c4 is better as well, I just push the king side. Yeah, now I just, don't I just take and then g4, h5 stuff? Mm -hmm. I think I should be good here. But maybe I'm wrong. Let's see, I've king may be the best. No, but I gotta be careful. Because his idea can be bishop d5, and if I trade, trade, maybe it'll be in time. I thought about king g4. Mm, or king f4. I'm not sure which one of these is better. So I've pawn on d6, a6, g5, this. Yes, pawns this there, this, this, this. So that is the position, I think, if I'm not wrong. Let's see, if king f4. Yeah, king f4, and I'm like bishop f3, and then, no, but just push here, say, 6. That's why I'm thinking king g4, so I have h5, and then king h4, g4, king h3 stuff. I'm not sure. But king f4, I don't know, it feels good as well, kind of. Maybe I should just play g4, and then g Yeah, I think I'm going to go, oh, g4 now, and king g5, h5, h... Yeah, g4, bishop g5, and if I take, take this, take... No, yeah, take h4, king 6, yeah, I think g4 is good. Let's try it. Okay, yeah, he goes king e3, and now let's go king g5, h5, h4. Oh, wait, I have pawn on h7. Aha, okay. h4, now it is g3, and maybe at some point I can even switch up and go with the d pawn. Doesn't this just win? Hold on, if g3, take, take. I don't know, he does something, I don't know what. Let's say he does something. I push g2, king f2, king f4. And I just go around, take this pawn and push, right? g3. Skin is on e3, yes, yes, yes. Oh no, but g3, wait, g3, g, g, h3 works. Yeah. This h3, h3, g. Okay, he takes, but this is just desperation. Uh, yeah, just take and game over. H4. Let's not remove because he can get p5. Yeah, and energy. I can push d1. Now, g2. Yes. Okay, that was a pretty fine game. Let's just bring my key over. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. It was pretty smooth. I love, I love g5 move. I say, no, I don't need your pawn. My king will use your pawn as a wooden shield, let's say. Uh, and yeah, it worked out pretty well. Let's see, was it nil, nil, nil? I think far from nil, 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 but I'm not sure. Do you think? I love that. Maybe it's not the best, but I think it was. Yeah, g5 only when you move. Otherwise, it's the draw and take, take. Maybe it was actually nil, nil, nil. I'm not sure. I think I messed up the opening a little bit. Or maybe actually nil, nil, nil. One nil, nil. <sighs> yeah, I had to play Queen C3. Queen C3 was better. You just had to castle. Okay, one nil, nil. Yeah, I thought queen c3, but I didn't see more than a draw there. Yeah, f6 was a terrible move for me. I just gave everything, pretty much. Queen f6, yeah, he had to not trade the queens, because this, I got rook 3, and I was totally winning. Yeah, I mean, he... 
Yeah, you have to cancel. Okay, so one new meal for me and two one one for him. For fifty seven moves was pretty fine. And he had to cancel. And okay, wait, G take no do not take rook a one, a four, I don't know. I don't know, bishop h three, bishop e four, g takes f, d four, rook c one. I don't know what was the move actually. Ah g five no. Ha, what's the move? Uh, H4, G5, ideas. Okay, now let's analyze my game. I played in Slav Open End, and I'm gonna end the stream. Once again, Snizzle Goop. I played one nil nil as well, right? I oh, know I played one one nil, okay. So, uh, one nil two for him, and one one nil for me. Yes, so absolutely one is B5 the correct move. It's actually not popular at all. Rook D1 here just has been played 30 times by Masters. Yes, so b5 is the most common continuation as it seems. Uh, then yes, knight e5. Okay, people play knight d5. Actually, the similar game OTB. Gonna check it. Okay, c6, b3. Take, take, bishop b7. This, okay, knight d5. But I played pretty fine. Computer says here, yeah, it was already super long time. He had 6 minutes 16 seconds, I had 2 minutes 20 seconds. Um, yeah, here I go for bishop before computer says, and now if he takes, so now if he takes, then it's a guaranteed queen trade. Um, because, uh, not queen, but all pieces trade. Because now after knight e4, he could have, I think, taken, and then yeah, play rook d, take a6, and I wouldn't, I wouldn't trade everything, and just a force draw. That was fine with a draw when I was that long time. Here I go for knight e5. And I would be better, because after 95, I mean, I had a minute 40 seconds, he had four and a half minutes. So he decided, okay, I'm just going to simplify trade everything. Queen d4, yeah, I really love this queen before move. Uh, otherwise, it still would be fine, but this feels better, because this I take, I'm winning. And yeah, queen c6, queen e1, that was a draw as well, after king h2 or bishop of 1. But he played 96, this is this, and end up a pawn up. He'll go for queen f6, and it would just be a repetition. But here he had to play queen f4, this take here, queen e5. Uh, take in g7, take, take, bishop d5, and yeah, it would be slightly better, but it would be extremely hard to win, especially with that little time I had. Um, but yeah, I played queen d3, and then I was like, wait, can't I just take? And now, because he played queen f3 in the game, we'll get to that later. If queen d5 would have 93, and if queen d8, this, 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 I take g2, and I'm winning. Uh, if queen g3, I take, take 93, b4, this, and then this, 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 I'm winning. And as he played queen f3, I took, then b4, he takes 92, and then he can stop my b-pawn. And takes, takes, I bring, run my, run my knight over, and this, and here, here is another one, then snizzle goop. So 1-1-0, one, one not bad, yeah, 95, but why I played 95? I was, yes, I said, probably, maybe you heard it, but I said, like, I'm not sure if it's the best move, because I just had no time and I couldn't sink more, you know? Uh, so, yeah, there was this game, oops, not this one, this one. It was a wide. Yeah, it was, he played a6, I saw, he was playing Catalan. Here he took and played b5, and he got me out of prep. He only played Catalan, so I prepped like every single line of Catalan. But then, yeah, this is, I wasn't sure, because 96, 96, 96 is there, but then he could have taken and sack even an exchange. Mm. I think Anand and Topalov played here. Or maybe not here. I'm sure, but it was something super similar. But Yana and Topalov played, and it was a crazy game. So I saw they played a4, take, take. Yes, I had to go for b3. After the game, I checked b3 was the best move. So then take, 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 and I take everything, and I'm fine. But I took, took, rook a8, take, take. Now I played b3, and now, okay, I played d3, it was an inaccuracy, computer says. I go for knight c3. I thought about knight c3, I just wasn't super sure. Yana would be just dead wrong. Um, Queen B3 just, we can agree, or Bishop of 6, Queen B3, but I played D3, I was thinking for a while about Queen B3, but I wasn't sure about Queen D4, I think he was fine, he went really nice when he went D7, take, take, and now yeah, he's just a pawn up, and Queen E5, E5 was a really nice idea, cause now if I take, yes, I think Rook C8, and I'm pretty sure it's just dead lost for me, if I move my Bishop, he takes the Rook, and otherwise I just cannot save my Bishop, um, 
So you have here, since I go for 92, I have played queen c3, queen d6, this, rook d1, this, queen e5. Already we were getting close to time trouble. You go for 94, and yeah, he would be already quite better. This is h4, c blunder. I was just at this point, I wasn't sure what to play. I was really on time, I had to go computer since I go for rook b1, uh, but I played h4. And he would blunt back, he'd go for b4, and then he would push the pawn, and it would be better. But yeah, he played knight d7, bishop g2, queen c7. And now c5 in accuracy, he'd go for rook c8, h took. And now, yeah, rook c8, if I were uh, queen b7, this rook b8. Now it was a draw, and as he took, I took on c5, takes, takes, and it was very drawn. And yeah, here, here for a draw, I accepted to move time control, but yeah. It was a crazy game, so I was like more or less familiar on how to play, but still unfamiliar enough to how to play because I was playing the, the other game with as white and here I was with black so that was a nice tournament I guess yeah it was yes yeah, so I was just un unsure what to play I understood that I should be fine because yeah he's a pawn down so maybe at some point I should just give the pawn away yeah really an interesting move never seen it before I think oh, maybe somebody played it against me I'm not sure let me check uh, rook d1. Uh -huh. Yeah, okay, that's the first game. And Liches, there was 2.5k games, so it's not a popular move at all, even on Liches, which is interesting. Okay, b5, 95, this, this. Okay, yeah, probably I'd go for 95. When I was unfamiliar, I was just familiar that somewhere here I should be fine. I understood, like, okay, maybe if I've not the best move, but otherwise, I mean, I'm just like stuck. Uh, okay, that was actually an inaccuracy rook f8. Computer says I'd go for bishop c8. I just wasn't sure where else, where after to bring that bishop. Knight d2. Okay, you, I say f5. And if f4, f8, e g4, knight e3 stuff. And knight f1, I go here, here, h4. This and I'm slightly better. Cool. Uh, 90, oops, 92. G6, B. Yeah, I mean, I just played G6 with the idea of bishop c8, bishop f5. No other idea, pretty much. This, yeah, I didn't like that move. I, I saw there was any accuracy. Here I go for, yeah, queen c3. And then pretty much take, take. Yeah, I have to go 95. Take, take. He probably even can play 94. Uh, yeah, 94. And he would be slightly better. I'm a pawn up, but. Yeah, he blocks every single pawn f and he pressures the weaknesses, so yeah. Because after queen b2, he just gifted me a tempo, and that was an inaccuracy. I'd go for bishop e4, and then take, take, uh, bishop f1, this, this, bishop c2, uh, 95, this, this. Oops, probably a b2, no, rook a5, b8 just loses queen c5. Uh, this and it would be equal. Okay, queen f3, that was a mistake from him. He had to go for bishop to e4. And after this, just take, take, knight a6, it would be equal. Yes, 95 was a mistake. But as I explained, I had no time left, so I thought that was like the best move I could do. Uh, just straight. He had to go for rook d8, takes, takes, this takes. And after takes, play a5. And yeah, I'm just better because if he takes bf, queen c5, and if rook a5, I, oops, I have this, I have that, rook d1, this, and that is winning. Mm. Yeah, so knight c5, this, this, this. I mean, I just want to simplify as much as I can, and then at some point probably force a draw. Let's see, knight c6, let me say here, go for queen c6, uh, and then queen e1, this, queen e1, I said this, uh, knight d2, queen e8, uh, king g8, queen e5, and just repetition. Okay, queen e1, this, uh, that was a mistake, I go for bishop d7, yes, holding my pawn, knight b8, this, and a bit better, actually, because I'm a pawn up, you know. Knight c7, this, that was a, any inaccuracy, let's say, a minus first, yeah, laid by here, but yeah, nice to have you, how are you doing? Here, I go for queen f6, bishop g here, this, 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 king g8, and it's just a repetition. Okay, cd, this, and yeah. I'm gonna say this multiple times. Yeah, that was just a blunder. I was like, yeah, I mean, I understand he said, yeah, bishop d5. Yeah, he'd go for e3 and it would just be drawn. And I'm like, wait, queen f2. How does he play? Because if queen d5, I have knight e3. Queen d8, this, queen d4, oops, queen d4, f6, f6, queen d7, king h6, and I'm just totally winning. Yeah, so uh, this doesn't work, and if let's say knight d3, he goes there, there, queen b7. First of all, I can push b4, or I can just take, 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 b4, king f3, b3, king e3, this, and I promote. Knight e3, but king e3, b2, and I'm winning. Yes, so that worked. 
Uh, what else there was? Yeah, I mean, if king h1, I go knight e3, bishop d5. I'm not sure if I have a queen trade here. I don't think I do. But probably... Okay, yeah, b4, I can just take this queen of one, this take with check, of course, and still crushingly winning. So, yes, this. What else? And yeah, if queen d3, I take... Take knight e3, and after bishop h1, I go here. Uh, this b3, yes, great move. This b2, and I'm just totally winning, can't stop the pawn. Yeah, uh, and yeah, he played queen of 3 queen of 3 takes b4, this knight d2, and then b3 just cannot stop me. I mean, yeah, and I'm just totally, knight, uh, totally free knight up, and this, and here is one of the names, Sneasel Goop, so that was an interesting game, I liked it. That was pretty nice. All right. Here and there, it's 292, no, 286. That was way too high. And yeah, I think I'm gonna wrap, wrap things up, guys. It was quite fun game against, uh, games against Stockfish. I'm gonna rate Art Vega. Good game is life open and quite good puzzle solving. So, everybody go ahead and join the Discord at Nan Base Out on Wendell Steam and Wordle Steam. Um, and yeah, really hope you had fun. Buy Manusverse, buy Karma, buy Iman, buy Darko, buy Comic Zero Seven, buy Oracle and Wit, buy Blaze the Ball, buy Pookie Eleven, buy B4141, uh, buy Andy, buy Tubular Chick, buy Ziggy Zaga, and buy Zane Ian. So, everybody, have a great day today. Hope you had fun and maybe learned a thing too. I, yeah, I'm gonna see you tomorrow. I'm gonna notify. Uh, what else stream and what else stream. Take care, everybody. Have a great rest of your day, and yeah, everybody, have a good one. Bye bye.